Hey, yo, 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 this is King Erna coming to you guys live and direct. Everybody in my DM, snatch this honor. Snatch that honor. Snatch YF and Lucci honor. Well, number one, I ain't got no proof when that guy being a rat. Number two, I ain't in the business of really, you know, just speaking on things no more. You know, a lot of times when you grow in maturity and the bag gets way bigger and your honor is intact. And I ain't talking about the bread of the big bag that dropped from me boxing, but you know, other things have grown since then. So my goal isn't to just run around and not have a knowledge of things. I want to make sure a dude is a rat before I snatch it. Like when we speak of different rats and we know when we have the hundred percent knowledge, then that's how we carry it. But youngins, I want you guys to be patient when it comes down to the honor snatching. I want you guys to get an understanding that honor snatching isn't to be cute or cool. Honor snatching is to give the people the understanding that honor is the action to loyalty. And we're going to point out individuals that turn on their friends, individuals that brought the crime to their friends or whoever, their associates, and then end up telling we're going to give you guys knowledge of true understanding. Not, oh, I'm just snatching. Uh, no, 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 no. I have a serious, serious fight coming up. Some people will say, King Gurna, why do you say it's serious? Well, anything that involves heart is always going to be serious. So although you may understand under your confidence that you have a win-win you still got to practice because what? Practice makes perfect. And guys like Mike Tyson that I look up to, individuals like Ivan Robinson, individuals like Terry Noah, Norris, Sugar Ray Leonard, individuals that got a lot of honor, Pernell Whitaker, Bernard Hopkins. They was just tremendously like the best athletes, that's why they all were champions. I have an interest in understanding to, to give the people who is who and who isn't. And it's been honored. And I see everybody trying to be like King Erna. Everybody. These guys were sitting around. They didn't have content. The only people that were speaking about rats was the mafia documentaries. Now we have King Erna, who snatches honor in a way no one can ever, ever come, 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 come close to doing. You know why? These guys are generics of what I have. Now, we have individuals that have different platforms that are doing very well, and I respect it and I honor it, but I'm not here to really jump out the window no more with no parachute or no goddamn ladder to climb down on. That's not what you do when you mature and you begin to have things and own things. You know, like literally own things. And when it's not from drug money or from the streets, you honor it a tad bit more. You honor your loved ones, your family members, your relationships with your friends, your brothers, and you keep it solid on all levels. Some people will say, King Gurna, King Gurna, why are you so confident? I was raised to be a confident individual, not a confidential informant like most of you guys. So my confidentiality, my confidence of a man doesn't involve in me telling or giving up information on other men. And it doesn't involve me booking people and giving them cases here under the honor regime in a negative way. So my goal is, before I call anybody a rat, I need to see the work. And if there isn't any work, I need to understand the circumstances of their case and what they told on and how they told on. Because guess what? You have individuals in our world that have accomplished the biggest of dishonor it is, and that's keeping their radism tucked. 
So with me, I'm going to tell the youngins today, make sure you kind of like stay to yourself. Make sure you stay off the streets. Make sure you don't go around individuals that is involved in crime. You know why? You could go to jail. And when you go to jail and you've been cool and you've been associated, you should never tell. Some would say, King Erna, are you serious? You mean to tell me you got a guy who's going to school to be a scientist? He's around a friend, some friends that are drug dealers. He gets locked up and he tells. I'm going to tell that young man, you shouldn't have been around them guys. If they are your friends, you have to bite that bullet and do the time and come home and be a better scientist. Because in that can, you're going to learn a lot more. You're going to have a lot more patience. But if you really want to stay away from it, just stay away from it. Don't halfway put yourself in. I'm King Erner from the Honor Your Life campaign. I have made lots of mistakes in life. Those mistakes just don't include me being a rat, pervert, sucker, or a kitten. But I do want to say this. That mutt, that mutt were purr in the second round. He, not the fourth, the second round, that mutt goes down. And guess what? He can get hecky kamaki. He can get pecky teleki, whoever he want to get. But when it comes down to the king of honor, I have some solid men behind me. I got Ivan Robinson as my coach. I got a beautiful woman. I am just living my best of life. Why most can't even live like they want to live. When it comes to honor, I am the restorer. When it comes down to honor, I am the one that put it in the people's veins because I woke it up in them. I gave them my understanding. Yo, this honor was buried. King Erna has risen it. Make sure y'all tune all the way in. Fight night coming live and direct. March 6, 2021. Make sure y'all tune in to BL, PPV, BLK, PPV dot BLK prime dot com. That's PPV dot BLK prime dot com. And check out the all access and the honor. It'll be coming soon. Live and direct.